Look, there's a puppy. Hello, puppy. What a cute party hat. Now focus, Miss Fortune. You have to make a very difficult choice regarding this puppy now. Be aware of the consequences. All right. I will play with it so we can share a nice time together. Good choice. Now throw the ball at it. What ball? This ball. Ah, that ball. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Puppy! What did I do? It's all broken now. Mr. Voice, everything I touch breaks. What's wrong with me? There's nothing wrong with you. Sometimes life is just unfair. But I'm here for you. Really? Thank you. Well, sadly. The puppy will miss the party now. What party? The owner of this dog, George, is having a party. I think you have to go and tell him about the accident. What accident? Ah, uh, yes, the puppy, yes. Let's go. It's just a bit farther ahead. All right. Oh, Red Bull puppy killer. I'm sorry I broke you, puppy. I really am. Maybe we can play later. You know, when I'm broken too. <laughs> I'll take the party hat as a symbol of our friendship, puppy doggy. It says, no dogs allowed. Oh, really? Oh no, I step on doggy do. Oh, oh, yeah. oh, sweet, I can see my footprint. Oh, sweet, I can see my footprint. Let's see what came out. I see a lot of glitter and... Is that rice pudding? <laughs> I can't watch this anymore. Please, let's keep moving. doesn't work. Do you see all the crap lying around? That's a good observation, Miss Fortune. <laughs> Thank you. So, Miss Fortune, at the other side of this lake, you will be one step closer to the prize of eternal happiness. And the party, right? Ah, yes, that too. You know, once at this lake, I got my head stuck in a plastic bag. I remember falling asleep and waking up in the hospital. <laughs> That's terrible. Yeah, I almost died. You're in big trouble, Miss Fortune. Yeah, tell me about it. Where are these birds taking me? I have no idea, but you have to do something about it, fast. All right. Okay, my glitter is shiny. So if I throw glitter at the birds, they will only see shiny. And they will get confused and leave me alone. That sounds like a solid plan, Miss Fortune. All right, here I go. Lighter attack! Uh, this is taking a long time. 
long time. We didn't even go that high up. Well, time seems to slow down when we are in danger. Am I in danger? Hey, look, a bird. Hello, bird. Oh, that was a rude bird. Why didn't I break my legs and die? Mm, you seem very good at falling. Thank you. <laughs> so, Mr. Voice, is the party on the same way to the eternal happiness? Yes. Yes, it is. Oh, that's convenient. Have you thought about how to break the news to George? About the puppy? Yes. I mean, if you want to. Of course, that's the least I can do for the sweet puppy. That is very brave of you, Miss Fortune. Thank you. Oh, look, a boat. Hello. Are we there yet? Just a little bit farther away. Ah, okay. Oh. Uh. What should we do about it? I'll keep it. His name is Rodrigo and he needs a new place to stay. I wonder if Rodrigo has heard about sushi. <laughs> it's like Rodrigo put in tiny pieces, you know? <laughs> And here we are, the house of George. I'm a bit nervous about introducing myself. You'll do fine. You're brave, telling the truth about the puppy. <laughs> Stop it. I'm doing it for the puppy, you know. Is answering. I'll invite myself in. Time to check out the party. I saw a man once floating in the lake, just like this fishy. Ah, oh, what a nice picture. I wish I had a picture like this with my mommy and daddy. Ah, oh, what a nice picture. I wish I had a picture like this with my mommy and daddy. Hello? What is it, Miss Fortune? Nothing. Are you sure this is the right house? Where is the party? Hello? Excuse me, are you George? Are you the owner of a puppy? Because I bring really bad news. Oh no, wait. It looks like he hung himself. Hung himself? Like a piñata? Should I hit him like a piñata? No, Miss Fortune. He's dead. Dead? But he's wearing a pair of sweet boots. He, he can't be dead. Oh, okay. Hey, Miss Fortune, I think this party's over. Let's leave. I'll meet you in the back. George, you know, now that you're dead, your puppy is gone. I like the puppy. Bye. Shadam! Happiness to George the Piñata! <laughs> okay, I'm here now. 
Let's go into the woods and get that eternal happiness. Yes. the birds and the animals. Dangerous animals, Miss Fortune. You might run into a fox. A fox? Like Benjamin? Yes, but all foxes are evil, so keep your eyes open. Oh, uh, all right. Hello? Everything begins with the song of a jackdaw. <laughs> All right. Hmm, interesting. I'll keep it. Hey, what do you have there? Nothing. Stay back, Miss Fortune. <gasps> what is it? A wild, dangerous fox. Wait, I recognize that black tail. It's Benjamin. It doesn't matter. Attack it before it kills you. No, I don't think Benjamin will kill me. <laughs> Hello, is your name Benjamin? Do you want to play with me? Oh no, don't go! Oh. <sighs> what a relief. We are safe now. Let's keep playing my game. Okay. There's a magical cave nearby. You need to find it. A magical cave? Okay. <laughs> oh, it looks like Benjamin likes to paint. That's pretty cool. I like that in a fox. <laughs> Focus, Miss Fortune. We need to keep going. Oh, okay. Okay. It doesn't look that magical. Just wait until you go inside. <laughs> oh, I like the sound of that. <laughs> I have a question. What does this sign mean? Oh, I don't know. Sparkles? Ah, cool. So, whenever you're ready. Oh, I can't wait to see the magic inside. Well, let's explore the cave. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> I'm just joking. There was no echo. It was me. You're a real comedian, Miss Fortune. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> 